I have some memory that some people are calling they have an idea called the dark big bang. Is that a thing? Yeah, yeah. We 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 invented that. I get to say it. We oh, invented that. Okay. Well, we were asking we we were realizing that people talk about there was an inflationary epoch of accelerated expansion in the very early universe. And at the end of that, that that energy, that the vacuum energy gets converted to ordinary stuff. And that's where ordinary matter would come from. And people usually think, oh, you make matter, ordinary stuff, standard model particles, you make dark matter, you make it all at once. And we, and we, we had the idea, well, wait a minute, what if you don't? What if the dark, ma the dark matter is produced later? And so we're going to say, okay, there's inflation early on, but then there's a dark sector. This, now we're talking about dark matter that does not at all interact with ordinary matter, which is, eh, you know, it's different. So if in this dark sector, you could have a smaller vacuum energy that later on converts to dark matter. You'd create the dark matter later. And the time that what we is, were, What does that buy you when you do that? What, well, the, what we wanted to do was push it forward all the way to the time when matter and, and radiation, matter radiation equality, in which case that would be kind of cool that you're producing dark matter right then. But we were unable to do that. So in, the farthest forward we could push it is one month after the regular Big Bang. So we have the dark Big Bang at one month, but that's human scale, which in the early universe is a really, really long time. Given the, the, the sequence of events that unfolded, a zillion things happened before a month passed. Oh, 